Hello Cardano community. Do you remember the first time that you ever created an NFT? The first time you've ever owned an NFT or a token or anything other than just ADA in your Daedalus wallet? I only remember this is like two days ago for me, so I figured I would share this experience with you. After watching Cardano 360 and seeing Patrick um, with his NFT-maker.io version 1 that's launched and able to make it, I figured it's time to make that happen. I had a promise to keep, and why not? So I figured I would also just hit record and play. So what you'll see next is a video that I created that is me stammering, messing up, probably doing it right, probably doing something wrong. I can use your help if you guys see something that I did wrong. Maybe if I had a different token to use instead of ADA, if there was a different platform I could have used. Um, this, this platform is version one, the NFT maker. I know that Patrick is working on version two and his team. Um, so we look forward to seeing that come out. Um, I had a couple of bobbles. I might've been my fault. It might've been a bug that's in the system. Um, you'll see where that's at, but, uh, I would love to hear any comments from you guys. One comment I used jump cutting. I used some uh, new YouTube techniques where you go from one syllable to the next and you cut out the ands and the ums and I don't know if I get, I'm totally sold on it yet, but maybe maybe it rubs you guys wrong. I'm only serving a platform of 60-ish wonderful, beautiful subscribers and anyone else who comes across this, um, not 60,000 or less. But uh, the point is I'm trying to get better at this and I'm not, I don't think I'm hurting anyone's feelings. The community of you all who are watching and following me right now are helping me get better because you're going through the paces, watching me learn, watching me do, and I'm hoping that I'm sharing with you watching what I'm doing. Maybe you haven't done an NFT yet and you're just waiting. It's easy. It, it really is. Um, but there's, there's some questions. I don't know if I did it right. Um, I did talk to Victor at the end. He did receive it. So, you know, all's well in that end. So I hope you enjoy uh, the following video. This is all about creating my first NFT, owning an NFT, being a member of the, of the hype and fair, fanfare and everything that is. Um, just as soon as I got my first NFT, I handed it off. So, um, there it is. Enjoy yourself. Uh, have a great day. And please hit the like, hit the subscribe, comment below. Let me know what I could do better. Let me know whether it's the content of the video or if I totally blew the whole concept of making an NFT. Um, who knows? Or maybe I got it right. Maybe I did it better than I do. No, I didn't. So let me know what I can do better. I do appreciate it. Y'all have a great day. Enjoy the video. Today, I'm going to try to mint my very first NFT. I know very little about this. My goal is to get a good idea of what it means to mint an NFT. I want to use um, Cardano's platform. I have to have an image to use. I made a promise uh, maybe two videos ago, three videos ago, when I was really excited about the voting app tool that helped out. And Victor, Lucio, and Phil K, I'll put that thing together. In that video, I was at, I think, 47, 48 viewers. And I said, hey, whoever is my 50th, I didn't know how to prove that. I didn't know how to show it. I'll reward you in some way. And so I took a screenshot on the top. Um, Victor Corsino actually was thinking he was the 50th. And the, to the best of my ability and my YouTube skills, I think he's the 50th subscriber. I made a uh, image in Microsoft. So <laughs> I made it redeemable for 1Q token whenever that happens. Well, I think this is a token and NFT. They're kind of the same thing, but like I say, we're still learning. I'm going to make this image an NFT. Speaking of tools that we need to have, we have our image now. We know what we're going to do. Um, I have to have an ADA wallet. So in my Daedalus wallet, I set up a special account, my Q Project Catalyst. If I get promoted, if I get become a cohort, if my project goes through, I want to make sure that one dedicated wallet exists that has to do with the money that um, is awarded to us. And so we'll go to that real quick. So I fired up the Daedalus wallet. Um, I put 100 ADA in there for myself just to get it initiated. Um, spent uh, 60 ADA on that for some graphic artwork, some other things that were associated with this. Um, also made a donation with some ADA. So that I'm a little bit under 10 ADA. I know that uh, making an NFT costs less than that, so this wallet should have enough ADA in it to make things happen. So my next step is to go over to nft 
maker.io. You may have seen it yesterday on uh, 360 where Patrick showed up from Project Catalyst who is living, breathing, sleeping, eating NFTs to help understand this on a different level. Um, one of our videos, one of the part of the series of that um, Fund 5 proposal interview with Q is going to be featuring what NFTs look like on Project Catalyst from a 30,000 foot view. Um, so I need to get a little bit of experience and I also need to be a man of my word and say, hey, here's your NFT um, as an award for being my 50th YouTube subscriber. So it seems pretty easy. I've only walked through it. I haven't actually done it yet, but we're gonna hit uh, mint NFT. It goes straight to upload my image. And now I need to bring the image in, set it down. So the image shows up, hit next, add my metadata. First, Q, NFT, Victor Corsino, 50th YouTube sub. Uh, let's see, okay, I'm gonna put uh, Q.io on this. That is my website, it is way, it's under construction to the sense that I own the domain name, but it's 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 got some work to do. I've got a really cool, layout and breakdown and uh, mind map of how it's gonna work out in the end, but we'll see what it looks like. So I'll put it in here just so that it exists. Also shameless self-promotion. And there we NF, NSFW, I don't even know what that is, but since it's optional, I'm gonna hit next. What do we have here? Okay, so payment after the payment, we'll move down after you and send it back to your wallet. This is 4.3001 ADA, so I think I need that number. Send the exact amount of ADA. If you need help, feel free to contact via support. And there's the address, so let's hit copy. Okay, nothing on there. So let's give it another try. I do not want to sit and cut and copy word letter for letter, especially when I'm getting this far. Ooh, anyone know that? Looks like we're gonna do this the hard way. Um, we'll give it a try the hard way. It's not able, it's not allowing me to paste it, cut it, copy it, or screenshot it. So, a D D R. Whoa, -ho. okay. All right, we did it the hard way, and we're there. So let's minimize that. Now my ADA, I need to go with 4.3001. With the fee and send. Now I need my spending password. So, open up my password safe. Send. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, Ada is sent, sending, sent. Um, Eight cent. Woohoo! All right, let's head back to our page. Oh, I didn't bring it up in time, but boom, we got that. We got the check mark. We got NFT minted and transaction submitted to the blockchain. I think I just made an NFT, and technically, I own an NFT now. So I'm in the hype. Ha! <laughs> Everyone's got NFTs. I've got one too. For now, oh, I don't know if I want to. I don't know if I want to keep this or if I want to. When it's Q's first NFT, Victor Corsino, my fiftieth NFT subscriber, by Q. So, what details do we have on the token? Ta-da! Token not found. It's probably because we're about six seconds into having owned an NFT. But it's cool. Took me over to Cardano Scan, and we'll take a look at it. But let's go back over to NFT Maker. There. I know that there's some FAQs that have to do with all the questions. Uh, there's some good information. I paid but didn't receive my NFT. What now? Contact us. And and I don't think that's going to be a problem, but if it is, it will. While we're waiting. Cool. So we just minted, I just minted, we with the community just minted the very first NFT for Q. And as of right now, it should be, will be, could be going to my wallet. Um, I know it's got a 
go through a cycle, get through a block. I'm not a pool operator yet. At some point that'll happen, but some amazing, cool, decentralized person is gonna have that transaction out into the ether world somewhere. Um, maybe it's one of the pools that I'm staking to, maybe it's not, probably not. The odds are against that happening, um, but there is a transaction that's going through the world. Um, while we talk, I'm looking at a few things and do, do, do. Hey, so on the side, I've been working with Mr. Victor. He's online at the time. He just sent me his receiving address. So I do have that, um, which means for this very brief moment, we, I get to own an NFT. But because I created it and because I'm sending it away, I will only own an NFT for a short period of time. I see it. Oh my God. All right, cool. Let's transition. There it is. So we're back in the wallet. My um, total went down. I have a token. That is my first token. Um, very cool. So if I, let me just let's see. There it is. There's policy ID. There's the asset name. I have no idea. Let's copy that. Let's see if we can work. Cool. So copy to clipboard. Now... I'm going to go check something else out, which is going to be, now we're going to go here and paste and enter. Let's give that a try. <gasps> there it is. Oh my God. All right. There's the address. There's that. The balance is zero. The value is zero. Yeah, right. This is the first Q NFT token. That value is going to go through the paper moon somewhere. How far is the moon if the world is flat? I don't know. All right. So the status is it's active. Controlled total stake is there. Rewards withdrawn. Rewards available. Delegate to. I'm going to tell you this. I don't even know what all this means yet. So we have our token. I have my send. That. Copy. Paste. I want to send that. Maybe. Token one, a minimum of one ADA required. Ooh, okay, now I'm outside of my learning curve. I don't know what I'm doing. Now I'm gonna have to research here. Maybe I have to send an ADA to him or not. I'm gonna add a token. That's what I'm trying to send, right? Let's close that. Let's go back to my summary. Unformatted native tokens are represented in energy. Let's cancel that. Oh, boys and girls, we are outside of charted territory right now. So my ADA was sent. My multiple tokens received. My confirmed address. I have a... I'm going to send this, babe. Paste. Do I need to send an ADA with this? Victor, you might get an extra ADA out of this. One. Token. That one. Two. Token number one of one. Do I just hit a one? Now it wants 1.48. Interesting. All right, this file is required. So how do I know... Well, I'll tell you this. It's a lot easier to mess around with a dollar fifty. Well, no, one point two six blah 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 math math. Less than two dollars worth of ADA and send this out to the Ether Worlds. And I think I know Victor enough that it does if it messes up. Whatever. But this is not on 
ETH, which would be, I have no idea how much. Screw it. Receiver. Oh, spending password one more time. Okay. Send. Multiple tokens sent. I don't even know I had multiple tokens, but I guess I did. Ah, cool. All right. I think we did something right. And by right, I mean we just made things happen on top of Cardano. On the blockchain. Sending goodwill and merriment to men, women, and children around the world. Let me close that. Password safe is closed, so that won't pop up in front of you. Boom. Okay, that's pending. All right, cool. I just sent a message over Discord to Mr. Victor and told him that it looks like something is going through. Um, ADA transaction happened, tokens received happened, multiple sent. Um, I'm kind of curious what it's going to look like on his end. We'll see if it showed up. Um, let's take a quick peek back. I'm going to try something. All right, I think that's it. Uh, I just made my first NFT. I just owned my first NFT using nftmaker.io on the blockchain of Cardano and using Cardano and making a bunch of Cardano stake pool operators happy and making the world a better place. I don't have it. I don't have it anymore because <laughs> I've already sent it off to an address. Um, I'll, I'll look look him up here in a little while and see if uh, he has a chance to check and see if he received it, what it looks like on his end. All right. Well, I just took uh, 20, 25 minutes, less than 30 minutes to go from start to finish. I had a digital image that I wanted to turn into a non-fungible token. That just happened. I used NFT Maker IO, and that sits on top of the Cardano blockchain. Um, I used some of my ADA, built the NFT, transacted the NFT into my wallet, moved it over to the wallet of the person that I wanted to have and hold and own that and cherish it and frame it, whatever needs to be done. But he is now the proud, proud owner, maybe proud, maybe not. I don't know. He was my 50th YouTube subscriber, so I'm proud. I'm happy that he's on board. I'm happy that he's doing that. Um, pretty good indication what I might do for my 100th and maybe my 200th and maybe my 123rd. I don't know. We'll see what happens. That was a fun experiment. That was a good trial. I loved it. Loved having you guys on board. Um, really look forward to continuing on this journey. Thank you.